And staying in the United States, Disney World is seeking to dismiss a lawsuit brought by a husband over the death of his wife with a bizarre argument. This February, Jeffrey Piccolo filed a $50,000 wrongful death lawsuit against Disney on behalf of his late wife. Piccolo claims he and his wife went to a Walt Disney World Resort in Florida last year and dined at a restaurant inside the theme park. His wife had a severe allergy to dairy and nuts, and they asked the waiters numerous times about allergen-free food. The restaurant allegedly assured them that their order would be allergen-free. However, shortly after eating the food, Piccolo's wife suffered an allergic reaction and died the same day on October 5th. A medical examiner confirmed that the death took place due to elevated levels of dairy and nuts in her system. Now Disney has responded to the allegations in a Florida court and has argued that the case ought to be settled out of court. Because Piccolo years ago agreed to the company's terms stating that users must agree to settle any disputes with the company out of court via arbitration. Piccolo allegedly agreed to the condition when he signed up for a one-month free trial of Disney Plus in 2019, and again in 2023 when he purchased the theme park tickets online using his Disney account. Attorneys for Disney say that when a person creates a Disney Plus account, they also agree to the Walt Disney Company's terms of use. That includes its affiliates like Disney Parks and Resorts. Now, lawyers for Piccolo have called Disney's arguments preposterous and inane. They say Disney is, re- is presenting a notion that if a person signs up even for a free trial of Disney Plus, they will have forever waived the right to a jury trial. Piccolo's lawyers further claim that the plaintiff is now suing Disney on behalf of his deceased wife, who never agreed to the terms. And now it remains to be seen if Piccolo will get justice for his wife's wrongful death or lose to Disney's bizarre claims when the matter is heard in court this October. From impeachments to inaugurations, if it's a political story, we are on the scene. The race for the White House is heating up. Kamala, you're fired. I say, bring it on. If it's breaking news, we're live with the latest coverage. From the White House, the State Department, and Capitol Hill, we know the issue. But above all, we know the players to bring you the latest in-depth analysis on all the key stories that we're covering. I'm Eric Ham. Join me from Washington here on First Post America. Climate change is on our doorstep. It's time for a revolution to take root. And it starts with 1.4 billion Indians. It starts with one tree. One tree for humanity. One tree for Mother Earth. One tree for our future. Project One Tree, a News 18 Network initiative. Across continents, one powerful news source. Bringing you diverse perspectives on the issues that matter. We go beyond the boundaries to give you that little extra about every sporting moment. So thank you for making First Post 5 million strong. We're counting on your support and you can trust us to bring you the news unfiltered and unvarnished.